Hey guys, what's going on? RT28 back again with another four package mail day. Uh, I'm gonna get right into it, and as I do so, I'm gonna explain a couple things. Uh, one is that the mail is gonna start slowing down here. I got some stuff I gotta take care of, and the other thing is Shattenkirk just his cup cards are slowing down on eBay and on many forums. So, I mean, I haven't had, I haven't. I don't have much that I need to bring in right now. And like I said, I'm not too worried about base and inserts and stuff like that. So, um, but if I see stuff, I'll try and pick it up as soon as possible. So here is what I mentioned in the last video. I accidentally bid on this on accident. Um, thought I, I forgot that I purchased the other one, but this one's cool. It's numbered one of 99. It's three colors as well. Nice autograph and a nice patch. Uh, I don't know. I have to look at both of them and possibly one of them are going to be available. Uh, but I'll keep you updated on that. Another thing is I was able to finally find the quad jersey for this rainbow. So really all I need now is the one of ones and that will be complete. And another thing is his Chattenkirk's the cup gold base auto out of 12. There were two of them on eBay. And I missed out on both of them. I don't know how. I was watching them. And then I got distracted. And ended up losing on both of them. Which really bothers me. They didn't sell for too high. And um, it was just my stupid mistake. But I guess that's part of collecting. So we'll see what happens. Okay. This one is nice. I really like this card. Um, it is out of 10. I think you saw the back already. But put that to the side. Holy Double package. Out of 10. Quad jerseys. 2 of 10. Um, I like how they have three colors. You know, you can't really get much better than that with Rangers stuff. But you got Shattenkirk, Lundquist, Kreider, and Zuccarello. And, uh, yeah, 2 of 10. I think there was one other one that I saw, uh, but it only had two colors. So, there we go. One last look. Nice card. And that being said... This, these next two are really nice, and they're both from the cup. Um, but that being said, if anybody can find any of these Shattenkirks from this year's The Cup that I'm missing, um, you know, the one of ones and a couple of the other low-numbered cards, and, of course, his gold base auto out of 12 that I keep missing out on, uh, please let me know because I'll tell you, that gold, that gold out of 12 is really making me mad. I'll hide that stuff. I was just, I, I don't lose on bids very often. I know what I have, or I know what I'm bidding on, and I keep track of when the, the, um, when the auction is over or when it's ending, and I ended up losing both of them, and that just doesn't happen with me. So it's kind of a personal thing now, but I'd really like to get those cards. I think they're beautiful looking, and uh, any of those base auto golds from the cup are good. Okay, anyways, limited logos. This one, before I show it, there are a lot of limited logos out there, Shattenkirk, when, when this product first came out about a month ago. And, uh, you know, I, I, I didn't pull the trigger on one early. I was actually waiting for this specific card, which sounds crazy, but I had a feeling it would have a nice patch, and it does, but this one is special. If you want to call it an eBay 101, you can. I don't think I don't I don't think it is, but it is numbered 22 of 50. His jersey number. Limited logos, patch and auto, and that's just a beautiful swatch right there. Um, a lot of his swatches are from the nameplate on the front, the Rangers logo, and uh, this one would be the away jersey. But either way, that's a great card. Real nice patch. I really like the design this year for the limited logos. And um, they could have made the window a little bit bigger, maybe. But that's still still a great card. And um, I'm happy I was able to get the 22 of 50. I knew that it would eventually pop up if I waited long enough. And luckily, my patience paid off. Okay, the final package here. A little bit of a background story. I can feel two cards. And I know one is a very big card. And literally, big and it's also big for the collection. Um, but the, the seller actually was real nice, but 
he took a long time to ship the cards and you know i paid a lot of money for this card so i i messaged him about it and he was very apologetic no hard feelings or anything like that but he did send me an extra card um to compensate the the long wait and i can feel it in here so i'm gonna pull this out first i have no idea what this is um it was just real nice of him to do wow no way wow that is awesome you know that is cool i haven't been able to buy one of these i wasn't really trying to because i could you know i can always get one later but now i don't have to worry about it he had the base and i was not expecting this at all he had the base out of 249 that is awesome so thank you definitely going to get a good review you were regardless um if, if i doubt he's watching but either way he was going to get a good review, but this is this just adds to it right here. I mean, that's awesome. People are awesome out there. And, um, you know, the hobby, there's a lot of respect with, with other collectors out there. So now I need the gold out of 12. So that just adds to my frustration as well because this would look great by the gold out of 12. You just keep falling over. But that is so cool. I was not expecting that, and I appreciate that very kind gesture. And this one right here is a big boy. And this was the one that I was waiting for. Um, trying to figure out where the front would be. Okay, so the front's the other side. All right. 101. Kreider. Lundquist. Shattenkirk. Triple button. And that card is as thick as my other button. I mean, that is just a very thick card. I can't believe they make one touches that or that are able to fit these cards i mean that is just thick this is this has some weight to it too but uh yeah this one was pretty pricey not gonna lie and uh the buttons are different shattenkirk's is different than criders and, and lundquist so that's pretty cool um i like the green foil i really do i think that it it adds a little bit of a different look to it and uh there we go just another 101 to add to the collection and this one's very unique uh, my second button now, second Shattenkirk button, but to have Lundquist and Kreider on there, can't beat it. Those guys are killing it. Well, Kreider's killing it this year. Um, and, you know, being from Pittsburgh, I do not like the Rangers at all. Never thought I'd be getting Rangers cards, especially of this caliber. But the fact that, you know, you got Shattenkirk on there and it's a one-on-one and these are buttons, you just, I had to go for it. So, yeah, that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching um like i said the mail day videos are going to start slowing down a little bit but i'm still going to get stuff in from time to time you never know what's going to pop up and um yeah so real nice gesture with this as well i appreciate that and what else did we get the limited logos and the quad jersey so there it is guys thanks for watching i appreciate it make sure to subscribe let me know in the comments when you want to see the Shattenkirk PC video, I appreciate it and thanks for watching.